So, those of you who are in my stream on Friday evening will know just how much effort, pain, and blood, sweat, and tears I went through to even attempt to complete this elite clue scroll. It, uh, it all began with the second stage, which asked me to go to somewhere in the Mortmire Swamp, and I need to complete the quest in aid of Mirekwe, which I did in about an hour and a half after a lot of pain. I'd never done the quest before, so it took me a long time, and after that, we got the clue in the Dorgashoon Mines, and no one, no one, not 700 odd people, including quite a few big streamers, and, uh, well, <clears throat> I don't think even the mods knew of some kind of glitch going on, but in any case, I did not manage to solve the clue on stream, so I had to wait, I went, uh, I went out or something, I don't know what I did. When I came back, I asked my clan, and, uh, one guy knew the answer to the, uh, to the clue, uh, to the challenge clue, and I managed to finish it, and I went on, went on and, uh, finished the clue scroll. So I'm bringing you pretty much the, well, the fast forwarded version of it, it took me about 15 more minutes to complete and it was about 6 more stages, it was a really long elite clue. It was uh, 12 stages in total so it was a lot of pain and um, a lot of banking and I wasn't really sure what I was doing so I had to sometimes kill the, uh, like right there I dug up the grave of the Bandos guard thingy and I ended up killing it with my fucking fists because I didn't, uh, well I think I forgot to rip my whip or something. But in any case after about 15 minutes I finished it off and this is just the uh, sped up version. I'm gonna show you the reward at the end but I wanted to take about you know a minute and a half, maybe two minutes just to talk about the stream on Friday because there were a lot of people in the stream. I think um, we peaked at around 700 viewers at 1.750 50, which is beyond anything I've ever encountered before in my streaming career so far. I've been streaming for about, um, what is it, like four or five months now? I can't exactly remember. I think I started in like February or something. So about four or five months, and I've never really gotten more than around 250 viewers. And the times when I got 250 viewers was already pretty ridiculous. But to hit 750 on, uh, on, on Friday was really not something I'd ever thought I'd ever get to. So that was really good. I really did enjoy the stream. Um... Uh, I say I enjoyed the stream, I didn't completely enjoy it, and I want to kind of talk about why, because I, like I said, I never really used, I was never really used to having that many viewers, and it was definitely something I had to get used to, a lot more chat spam, the PM spam, the Twitch spam, it was a lot of multitasking, and I have to say, it was actually a lot more stressful than I'd uh, first thought, I thought it would be quite, quite enjoyable, just in general, quite enjoyable to have that many viewers, you know, when you watch big streamers like Boaty, Spark, Mark, you think, you know, they're probably really enjoying themselves, but with me, it was a really, it was really, it took a lot of getting used to, and what I have to say is that a lot of people in the stream were just trolling the hell out of it, uh, trolling the chat, spamming the chat, and just being generally exceptionally rude, and while I didn't really react at all to those people on the stream, I was kind of thinking about it after the stream. Now, usually I never ever let haters get to me, um, well we call them haters, whatever you want to call them, trolls. I never really think about it, but I have to say, I was never really, I've never really been used to having that many people trolling in one stream at one particular time, so for me it was actually quite a stressful experience to go through, and um, thinking about it, I kind of much rather having a stream with like, you know, 50 to 100 viewers where I can interact with everyone talking in the chats. I did realise that a lot of my regular viewers didn't I, th I don't think they were in the stream much, didn't have very mod very many uh, mod moderators in the stream either, so it was kind of me just not really talking to anyone I knew, so it was a little bit strange in that sense, but for the people who did enjoy the stream, I really do hope you enjoyed it, and many thanks for sending a few messages after, when I came back online the next day I got plenty of nice messages, but that is the end of what I'm going to talk about, uh, I would have liked to talk a little bit more, but I'm going to leave you guys with my reward for this clue scroll, which is coming up any second now, and uh, my reaction to it, which is quite short, it's not really that great, but uh, hope you guys enjoyed the commentary, if you did, please do feel free to leave a subscribe and a like, and don't forget to follow my Twitch, twitch.tv slash strongguy, link is in the description along with a few other links for you to check out, and I will catch you guys in a later stream slash video, see ya. Okay, so I just finished my clue scroll, my elite clue scroll after so much pain, and I got a briefcase. Yeah. So, I'm wondering, is that rare? Is that expensive? <laughs> I know that it's a new item, so I'm happy about that, but... <laughs> it's only done. I just... Oh, I don't even care about the reward, man. I'm just so happy it's done. Uh, oh my god.